What is going on everybody? It's your boy Witterboy and I'm going to show you the car that you never knew you'd love so much. Uh, the pink and green color scheme I've got going on here that actually matches the car quite well because because it is just it is a goofy car which I have properly named the toot car uh, and you will see why. It's a Fiat X1 by 9 just get there real quick and I'll go ahead and upgrade this. You guys can skip forward a little bit if you want. There we are. Fiat X 1x9. So, this car has a couple of interesting features. Um, and I will get to that in just a second. Um, the car is only 24,000 credits, which is a great deal for the novelty that this car brings into your life. You don't have to upgrade a lot so this car won't break the bank. Uh, it's kind of fun to show friends. I have messed around with this car for about two hours now and have almost, I'm almost numb to the hilariousness that it is. But if you guys have never seen this car, you're probably going to laugh your asses off. Because I, I know I did. My bro did too. He was over here. We were, we were just randomly upgrading random cars. So all you need to do... You're going to keep the engine the same. You don't need to upgrade that. And all you got to do is just put a single turbo on it. And then we'll go into the engine and completely upgrade that turbo. And that's it. So for a total price of about 30,000 credits, you can laugh your ass off at this car. Uh, for a couple of reasons. If you fully upgrade the car, it's going to cost you a little bit more, um, but that's another novelty piece of it. I'll actually get that other one that I've got because it's fully upgraded. There she is. What a beauty. Mmm, what a masterpiece. But there's a couple of interesting features about this, and uh, I'll get out of the Horizon Festival real quick. So we'll actually get out here from the main road where it's a little bit less quiet from all the crowds. And I don't know if you guys could already hear it going on. It's already making me laugh a little bit. If anything, I grin. Okay, so there, there's a few stipulations about this car. Um, the first one, I don't know if you guys heard the blow-off valve whenever I was coming out because of that turbo. Uh, but this has got to be the absolute goofiest blow-off valve I've ever heard on any car in any Forza game. It doesn't exactly blow off, it more, uh, more or less toots. <laughs> you guys hear that? It just, it toots. It doesn't really blow off, it just toots at the... <laughs> okay, okay, I'll get, I'll get back to the tooting here in a minute. Uh, the second thing that is about this car is it is annoying I, I really don't recommend this for any actual uses because fully upgraded it's like a high S1 class and uh, it, it doesn't go that fast it only goes like 160 miles an hour fully upgraded but whenever you get into the RPM range of about 7500 all the way to red line see like right now it kind of sounds cool for what it is being a stock motor and everything get the toots going and then once you hit about 7500 rpms it just gets absolutely annoying to listen to like it hurts my ears and i want to shift but i'm trying to get the most out. listen to this it just it sounds so bad good lord like it sounds good whenever you get there and as soon as it hits 7500 rpms bam super annoying makes you want to jab your ears with a freaking pin needle I swear. Now, the third stipulation to this wonderfully awesome car, aside from the fact that it toots, and aside from the fact that it makes you want to, uh, you know, kill yourself, um, most of the drivatars that you come across, for some reason, this little Fiat here, you know how the game matches your cars to match, uh, you know, what car you're driving, albeit like if you're driving a muscle car, you'll have a bunch of uh, muscle cars. Uh, JDM stuff, you'll have a bunch of JDM cars floating around. No, no, you get this little Fiat, uh, you better be looking at supercars all day, bro. Because that, it's in a class of its own, this car is so amazing that, 
you only are going to be able to face supercars. That is the only match. I like to face. Terribly slow. It is god awful. Look at this. Every single one of them, freaking supercars. The only other thing you might find is going to be like uh, sports classics. It's going to be like some really old Jaguars. Look at it. They're all supercars. They're all freaking supercars. Like, why does this Fiat bring about supercars? Is it the toot? Is it like a, is the toot a mating call? I don't know. Come here, McLaren. Listen to my toot. Toot. Yeah. Yeah. You want none? what I thunk I did. Okay, guys. I'm not going to draw the video out any more than I have to. <laughs> I just want to show you guys this awesome car. Anna, I swear. Um, yeah, it just toots a lot. It toots. It's annoying to listen to. And in case you ever want to be uh, unmatched and be completely wrecked by every single AI on the board, then uh, here you go. This is the car for you. It's a cheap. It's a budget car. It's fun. And it toots. What more could you possibly want? Peace out, dudes.